Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Lang. Uh, just a quick introduction. I'm the administrator of the group Doctors of Physical Therapy, New Grads in the Real World. I go to Damon College in Buffalo, New York, and I'll be graduating in May of 2016. So I just wanted to share some things with you um, along the way, maybe some tips as I'm going through the whole job application process, studying for the boards and things like that. So today I, I came up with a way to keep track of job applications or any companies that I am in contact with um, because even though I don't graduate for another five, six months, I've already had some travel agencies or different staffing um, or networking companies contact me. And so I kind of want to keep track of where I've applied or where I've had a phone interview with. And I just wanted to show you the way I'm doing that. So I'm going to do a screen share. And so you should be able to see right here, I'm just using Google Drive. Um, it's an Excel sheet and maybe this is a little OCD. Um, I really like to stay organized for things like this because I know following up is really important. So just knowing like when you applied, how soon you should follow up and things like that. If anyone has tips on that, let me know because obviously I haven't really applied for jobs before. But what I'm doing here is on the left-hand side, I'm putting the company's name. Um, so just a couple of companies that I've been in contact a little bit with where I heard about them. So a couple I heard from at a networking event that we had at Damon College. And another was a presentation that we had in class that he came to tell us more about home care. And it's actually in my hometown, so I put that. So date applied, I haven't really put in any applications, but I have been in contact with these people. Um, I put their email address and phone number as well as the contact person's name. So for some companies, it's going to be their hiring manager, recruitment, human resources, and obviously I can add more than one person if I'm talking to more than one person in that company. I also add location, so I can easily search and see which places in Rochester, uh, which is my hometown, have I applied to versus um, maybe travel companies, um, as well as different types of clinics I might have applied to. Um, so if I want to go look at all the ortho ones I've applied to, I can just search ortho and then um, it'll kind of highlight all of those. And then I, I'm going to have a little note section over here. So put a date where I did an informal phone interview or a date someone left me a voicemail. So I'm thinking either over here on this end or maybe toward the front after date applied, I'll give myself a follow-up date and then I'll just go and check this every few days, see if I should be following up with anyone. Um, maybe somewhere I can say what kind of application it was, whether it was electronic or if I mailed it in or if I even like stopped by the company at all. Um, so if you guys have any other ideas for this or if anyone wants my template, just let me know. I'd be happy to share. Um, again, if you have any friends that you think would um, be able to enjoy this group as well for networking, learning from each other about job applications and future um, resources in terms of board prep or maybe you're out in the field already and you're just trying to, you know, fit into your new role as a physical therapist, please share your ideas. Let me know what else you'd like help on. Um, honestly, helping you guys is helping myself because I'm learning along the way and I'll just be sharing what I have uh, learned with you. So let me know again if you have any other questions. Um, this is my first video. I'll try and do some more and hopefully they're helpful. Thanks guys.